Good part of the day, dear students. Today our topic is unusual cities and uh, in this lesson we will work on your reading skill. Before starting doing the exercises, please try to answer this question. Which is the most beautiful city in your country? And try to give reasons to your answers. Then, please look at these photos and answer this question. Do these cities look like good or bad places to live? Please give reasons. Here are four cities. And before doing the reading tasks, uh, pay attention to the reading strategy. When you do a matching task, read all the texts first to get a sense of the overall meaning, then go through the questions one by one. Decide which text you think contains the answer and look for it carefully. If you can't find it, look at the other texts. Now exercise two. You have to read the texts, then match them with the photos. One of the texts matches two photos. In this exercise, you shouldn't read all the text and don't worry if you don't understand every word. Just try to skim and get the overall meaning of the text. So here are three texts. The first one is Green City. The next one is Artificial City. And the third one is Recycling City. The next exercise. In this exercise, you have to match each question with one of the texts. In order to do this exercise, you have to underline the keywords in each text. The next is uh, exercise four. In this exercise, you are going to explain to, uh, the significance of these numbers and measurements from the texts. For example, Karichiba has a population of about 1.7 million. The next exercise is connected with the vocabulary. In the text, find the missing words for the compass points and continents. As you see uh, here in the picture, the west is shown. The next exercise. Uh, you are going to work in pairs and complete the sentences with the correct words from exercise 5. For example, Canada is to the north of the USA. The next one is exercise 7. Here you are going to work in pairs and write more sentences like the ones in exercise 6. Include facts about your own country and its neighbors. Uh, in this exercise, uh, you will write five sentences. The next exercise is also a pair work. Uh, you have to ask and answer questions about the cities in the texts. Use superlative form of these adjectives. For example, which city is the most attractive? I think Karichiba is the most attractive. So you have to use the superlative form of the adjectives. And your home task uh, is the all exercises of unit 5F from Solutions Elementary Workbook. Thank you for attention. See you soon.